Good morning, High Point. Today is an A day. Juniors and seniors, check your email for information on the first peer counseling meeting Wednesday evening at 5.30. Attention all student council members, there will be a student council meeting Wednesday, September 14th during unit lunch A in the auditorium. Pride, peers rejoicing in a drug-free environment will be holding its first meeting on Tuesday, September 20th at 2.30 in room 120. All students, both old members and new, are invited. Pizza and beverages will be served to all students who attend. If you would like to apply for the National Art Honor Society to see which see one of the teachers for an informational paper, you have until November to apply. Attention freshmen interested in running for student council. Petitions are available in the student council office. They must be signed by other freshmen and returned to the student council office by the end of the day on Friday, September 16th. Speeches will be during the unit lunch on the 19th. Attention Foreign Language National Honor Society members, please meet in room 425 at 2.30 today, September 12th, for a mandatory meeting. Please be prompt. See Senora Aiello or Senora Carol Matthews if you have any questions. Attention International Club officers, we have a mandatory meeting in room 417 at 2.30 on Tuesday, September 13th. Please be prompt. See Senora Carol Matthews if you have any questions. In sports. During an intense High Point uh, Lenape Valley 0-0 regulation game, followed by a 10-minute sudden victory over time, the field hockey game finished 0-0 despite a High Point 19-6 advantage in shots on goal. The Lenape Valley goalie, Kaylee Glenatucci, made 12 saves. McKenna of High Point had two saves, while the stingy defense thwarted off the, off the Lenape Valley middle field play. The varsity boys soccer team won a challenging contest against Lenape on Saturday, 3-0. Justin Akengo, Jake Malvitt, and Jacob Sorensen found the back of the net, assisted by Jack DeGroot and Ryan Freda. A strong defensive effort earned the shout out, shutout for a Garrett Potter in the net. Well done. The JV boys soccer team won a hard-fought battle against Lenape on Saturday, 3-0. The team came out on fire in the second half, netted three goals by Alex Foster, Kevin Labar, and Andrew Misak. Assists were recorded by RJ Brevett and Charlie Topher. The defense played and played fantastic and earned the shout out for birthday boy Trey Osborne in net. Great job, boys. Attention all returning JV and varsity girls basketball players. We will have a brief meeting on Thursday during unit lunch. We will meet at 11 for about 10 minutes in room 427. The girls' soccer teams recorded solid victories for both Varsity and JV against Lenape Valley on Saturday morning. Varsity won by a 2-1 margin with goals from Morgan Solon, assisted by Megan Kelleher, Jackie Harnett, unassisted. Junior Varsity won in the convincing fashion with a score of 7-1. Goal, goals and assists were tallied by nearly every girl on the team. Today's lunch, mashed potato bowl with popcorn chicken, corn, and cheese. Dinner roll, fresher chilled fruit. Today's birthdays and over the weekend. Trey Osborne, Santonio Van Hooker, Terry Harden, Tyler Leadfor, Corey Steinhardt, Cameron, Cameron Warmth. Happy birthday, guys. Have a great day, High Point.